Post holiday travel rush is in full swing. Millions of Americans are returning home or heading to their New Year's Eve destinations and also dealing with dangerous weather. So far, it seems things are pretty smooth as a major storm moves across the country, though. ABC's Rena Roy has the latest. Heavy snow pummeling parts of America's heartland. Authorities shutting down a portion of this highway near Elizabeth, Colorado, the area under a blizzard warning until Wednesday morning. And from Denver to the Kansas border, I-70 eastbound closed for a time, drivers being diverted off the interstate. People trying to navigate the slick, snow-covered roads. Similar scenes in Nebraska where drivers have been facing whiteout conditions. Parts of I-80 closed after a big pileup. The dangerous weather right in the middle of the holiday travel rush. The same system now heading east. Many are already dealing with dense fog in New York and Boston. Haunting morning fog also delaying some passengers in Manchester, New Hampshire. And I got another text on the way to the airport. My flight on December 26th from Manchester now departs at 1107, but now I think it's actually delayed even more. Meanwhile, in Atlanta, some passengers tell us they waited over an hour and a half in the security line. So I think we're going to wait probably twice as long as our flight. Our flight is two hours, but we're already an hour and a half in. This is how long we've been standing in line. No, no, we're this still in the overflow the area. Yeah. But overall, things have been pretty smooth so far. Delays and cancellations limited. And this holiday travel season keeps breaking records. The TSA says on Friday alone, it screened 2.7 million passengers. Rena Broy, ABC News, New York.